arrived at the hotel and normally it only takes well it should only take me an hour by car to get to Sarabaya but today because it was Saturday and I came at around 12 ish one so there was a lot of traffic so it actually took me about three and a half hours to actually get to Sarabaya um, normally in the past when I came here it took me about two hours by bus I will head back on Monday and today is Saturday and um, yeah because of the cat scratch I have to get rid of these shot and those are in a series of three so I will get one today one on Sunday and then one on Monday before I head back to site but yeah I don't no, if I'm really gonna even be doing anything, but hey, I came to Zerabaya, so I might as well vlog about the time I, that my cat attacked me. Literally, this morning I got up and um, went outside of my room, and then my cat decided it was gonna attack me. Uh, I think what had happened was I think the cat had like some kind of a fight with my little host sister right before I got out of my room so the cat was super worked up already and when I stepped out of my room the cat was I think I had to walk past the cat and when I did walk past it it just kind of like latched onto my my leg so the cat scratch is right behind my um, like but I'm not gonna show you guys because you can't really see it anyway and it only bleed for a little bit so it's totally no big deal but I think um, I'd rather be safe than sorry and get some rabies shot hey guys so I just got back from the Peace Corps office where I got my shot and really it's it's just like a vaccine shot, so yeah, I have to get another one, Munkin, maybe, <laughs> maybe in like 48 hours or so, I'm not sure yet. On my way back, I grabbed lunch, and Munkin, or, why do I keep saying Munkin? Munkin is the Bahasa Indonesia word for maybe, and uh, maybe that will, it will also be my dinner, but um, yeah, I pretty much grabbed the same thing as yesterday, but I thought, hey, you know, before I gobble everything up, I might as well show you guys what I got before I start eating. So let's check it out. So here is my coconut juice, the infamous coconut juice that I have almost every day because I love coconut juice. And I have them put just a little sugar in it because usually they put a lot of sugar in it and I don't really like it too sweet. But this was a 5,000 rupiah and back in Mojokerto or in my village it was 4,000 so here in Surabaya in the city things are a little bit more expensive and then I got this fruit rujak thing but I didn't really care for any of the other fruits so I only asked the vendor to give me mango and jackfruit and jackfruit in Bahasa Indonesia is nanka so I learned that today I was learning something new and then it also comes with this paste, this peanut butter um, paste, and it's called Rujak. It's super, super, super yummy. And then, of course, I got the buns again because they were super delicious yesterday. So here is the bun ayam with the chicken, and then in there is the bun special chicken. And it's really good. So this was 10,000 rupiah. And then this was a little bit more expensive, 15000 So normally if you just buy fruits in the pasar, they're not that expensive. But when people have to prepare it for you like this with the rujak, it's a little bit more pricey. And yeah, so this was 15000 So this is my lunch and maybe dinner, but I think I might go out to eat somewhere for dinner. Although I do hate going out to eat by myself.